In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to reset Razer the Feather Essential. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. If you have any model offered a Razer the Feather, or in particular the the Feather Essential, follow these steps and you will be able to reset it. There are two main ways to reset your Razer mouse. So the first one is going to be through a combination of buttons, however there is no guarantee that this will work, it seems like it is an exclusive button combination to only some models of the Death Adder in different lineups like the Basilisk, but I still recommend trying this out first. So to start, disconnect it from your PC, so if it is currently plugged into your PC, make sure that you disconnect it, and then press and hold the left mouse button, the middle mouse button, and the right mouse button. So press the left click, the right click, and the middle mouse button simultaneously. You have to press these three buttons down and while you do this, connect the mouse to your PC through one of the available USB ports. Keep holding down all of these buttons for about 7 seconds after you connect it to your PC. Eventually you will see some sort of LED indicator flash or you will hear the sound notification that a new USB device has been connected and it should be reset. If it doesn't work, then follow this up with the secondary method. To do this, you will need to download Razer Synapse. On this screenshot, I have Razer Synapse 3 as an example, and all that you have to do is go into the profiles. So every single time that you connect a Razer device to Razer Synapse, it will be assigned a profile. By default, it is going to have the base default profile, of course, where nothing is changed, all of the buttons are factory default, and if you set up a new profile, then all that you have to do is choose it from the list and then switch to default. Or you can tap these three dots here, click on them and then find the option to reset this particular profile to default. As long as you choose the option to de delete a pre-existing profile or you reset one that you selected, you will be good to go. This is how it looks for Razer Synapse 4. Of course, I have a different mouse here as an example, but the process is the same. You click on the mouse that you want to manage, in this case it would be the essential, and you will find the profile options at the top left. You just select the profile, reset it or change it to another one, and double check all of the categories to make sure that everything was properly reset. I hope I was able to help you on how to reset Razer Death Adder Essential. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.